and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. This is your weekend message for Saturday the 14th going into Sunday the 15th of July 2019. Thank you so much for joining me if it's your first visit welcome. If you are returning then welcome back and thank you. For this weekend's reading I am using the Green Witch Tarot by Anne Mora. Okay, my wonderful friends, <clears throat> let's see what the weekend has in store for us. What is the message? Thank you. For my wonderful friends. Thank you. From Spirit. For Saturday the 14th going into Sunday. Thank you. <clears throat> okay, my friends, your first card is the wonderful Ace of Wands. Followed by the Knight of Wands ones and followed by major arcana number 11 standing stone your first card is the ace of wands and straight away i am thinking to the um the cards from the secret language of uh, colour for the week and we had cherries live an extraordinary life um, you're still being encouraged to do the same my friends living an, an extraordinary life uh, aces are beginnings they are births they are this could be um uh, a, a real birth in the physical you know uh, motherhood uh, parenthood um, but it also could be the birth of an idea of, of something new. I'm feeling, as this is wands and this is um, fire energy, uh, I'm really feeling that this is the birth of an extraordinary life about to happen, my friends. I am feeling that this is the birth of your your passions, your ambitions, your dreams, your goals, um, and I really, really love the purple skies um, because I do feel that, you know, I, I'm looking at this illustration, I'm really feeling that the sky, the sky is the limit or there really is no limit because um, from our perspective in Earth, we can't even touch the sky. So I'm really feeling that nothing's stopping you this weekend at all from living an extraordinary life, from achieving all of your goals your dreams your ideas your passions there's real potential here my friends for you to go out there and get exactly what it is that you want from life okay next we have the wonderful knight of wands well the knight of pentacles is my friend uh, claire and flash uh, well this would be me and ruby <laughs> and don't we look absolutely fabulous i love my green dress and knights they are about action they are about journey they are about Impulse. I'm really feeling following an impulse, an impulse that is really about your ambitions. So I do see you um, following this impulse, uh, going on an adventure as nights are about adventure. Um, they are about movement, action, a forward movement and journey. So for some of you, this could be going on holiday taking a break, relocating even. Um, and the Knight of Wands, passionate, really, really passionate, adventurous, courageous, brave. Uh, and this is what I am seeing um, this weekend, my friends. You are about going out there and getting 
what it is that you want, what you desire, your passions, your dreams, your visions, your goals. You are on the way this weekend to achieving this, I am hearing. And next we have Major Arcana number 11, Standing Stone. Major Arcana, as they speak of your inner world, your inner knowing, your major inner knowledge. And the inner knowledge that you have this weekend is, is, is you being fed light. Light is information. Uh, so I really feel that you are receiving information, impulses, ideas that are coming from the spirit realm if you like or from within um number 11 the standing stone is about balancing out your mind um it's all about definitely about balance as we have the scales here on the stone it's about fair outcomes it's about honesty and integrity and a fairness it's about equality it's about situations that that work out and as we look at this illustration we see that the standing stone standing very solid harm none the very motto of this standing stone and surrounded by smaller stones and then right in the middle there we have a spider and a cobweb it's kind of join those last two stones together so i do feel that this weekend, my friends, you are really going to, it's going to come together for you. There's a real fairness that's going to be coming around for you. Um, the scales are balancing out. Um, it's coming in your favour. Um, this is a real, I'm feeling this is a situation that's really working out for you. Uh, daisies, uh, daisies, they are freshness, newness, um, spring. So this weekend, my friends, I really feel that you are going to be receiving some ideas and impulses. I feel it's going to spur you forward uh, into movement to chase your dreams. Um, this, I really feel that there's some... Um, you're coming together this weekend. Um, there's going to be a fair outcome. This is a situation that is really going to work out for you. And it's all based around you being this balanced um, standing stone. Um, honesty, integrity, um, with harm to, no, uh, harm to no one. Ooh, <laughs> okay. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Which is Wisdom, Barbara Mickle John Free and Flavia Kate Peters. What is the message for my wonderful friends? Thank you. Oh, okay. We have been given two. I'm going to just lower the camera make more room and I am feeling like that okay and we have spell manifestation wow coming underneath the ace of wands hearth homecoming and wands fire energy heart energy uh, coming home to yourselves my friends this weekend because you are coming from an, a place of honesty truthful integrity um or oh, a real this real fair outcome this weekend my friends okay spell manifestation This is a good time for you to work any spells, for magic abounds. Your manifestation abilities are heightened and a magical energy runs through all that you put your focus on. Your gift at this moment in time is to bring about what you desire. And it is strong as, you are, as your understanding of the elements 
herbs and candle magic unfolds. But remember to be careful what you wish for, as you could blind as you could be blind to any unforeseen factors if the action you take is not for the highest good. Manifestation asks you to heed the threefold law and to remember that whatever you send out comes back. Be transparent about your wishes and take into consideration any consequences that may occur to all living things as an outcome. Living accordingly in harmony with a level of consciousness that will harm none <laughs> and be aware of your thoughts and words at every moment. Master this and you will be in a position to receive all that you have asked for. Make a wish or cast a spell. Your magic works so very well. Be sure to keep the threefold law. Gifts will abound all the more. <laughs> wow. Okay, and our next one is hearth. You've heard the phrase, home is where the heart is, right? Well, it certainly rings true for you at this moment in time. The hearth calls you back to the bosom of your family, to return to the centre of what really is important, to remember where your loyalties lie. This is a vital time now for you to enjoy some home comforts, where you can relax and be the real you. You're done with pretense and keeping up with others for appearance's sake. It's all been rather fast-paced for you, and it's time to slow things down and take it easy. Hearth invites you to return back to basics for a while, where you can rest in the warmth and sup some nourishing soup. Here within your very own space, you can review your priorities and maybe rework that schedule of yours. But for now, curl up and focus on some peace and well-being and welcome home. It's time to do something for you. Stop racing round. Don't do the do. Return to that which you know best. Enjoy some warmth and well-earned rest. Oh boy, after all of this action, remember to rest. <laughs> Be still like the standing stone. That's what this standing stone is getting some balance. I mean, 11, the standing stone, it's also justice. So which is why we're talking about balance and fair outcomes. OK. Oracle of the Unicorns, Cordelia Francesca Brabs, whom I lovingly call my trusty steeds. <coughs> real fire and passion coming back into your lives my friend and it's all coming from this wonderful basis uh, this wonderful standing point that you are now coming from this stance that you are coming from uh, you are fairer fairer with yourself you are fairer with other people um, you're there's a real honesty uh, and integrity about you wow What is the message for? Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> and your unicorn is? Oh no! Hope back again! <laughs> Stay positive! Really being plugged home to you, my friends. Stay positive because staying in that positive energy is, is keeping you in a higher frequency. And please know, the worst is not only just behind you, it's way, 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 way behind you now, my friends. So you can look up to the light, feeding you information, information that you can act on. Act on with confidence, with passion, um, knowing that it's, it's coming from within so it, it, it's you coming home to yourselves um, i couldn't have put it better myself with this card uh, all that is really left to say my friends this weekend is welcome home <laughs> oh wow 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 what an absolutely fabulous message and you get me and ruby right in the middle of it as well <laughs> couldn't be more wonderful well, thank you for all of your likes, your shares. 
Welcome new subscribers, thank you so much for your support. You have joined a wonderful family of kindred spirits and thank you too for your warm, kind, encouraging comments and emails. I really enjoy receiving them so do keep them coming. And so, may favour be with you all as I wish you a joyful, a peaceful and a truly blessed weekend. And until Monday, my friends, goodbye.